right here you guys have screws that are used to hold into to hold in the rotor I want to make sure that I can get those off um, before I uh, take off the caliper and replace the brake pads because if you can't get these nuts off or these screws you're not going anywhere so so I picked these up from Harbor Freight they're uh, what I like about them is the shank goes all the way through it's metal all the way through from this end to this end so what I'll do is I'll get a hammer you don't have to get one this big but uh, you basically put the screwdriver in place and then usually it doesn't want to release so I'll just take the end of it hit the end of the screwdriver and as I'm hitting I'll just start turning it see got it free do the next one come on baby I got that one off too. Excellent. I will actually reuse those when putting on the new rotor. So quick tip, if you guys couldn't get these uh, screws out, the uh, rotor screws, if you couldn't get those out by the method I showed you, um, you can always heat it up with like a propane torch or if you have access to an oxy acetylene torch, but just be careful because that thing gets really hot super quick. Or you could try some penetrating oil and if all else fails, you can always drill it out. You get yourself a drill and just punch a hole down the center and get it loose that way so just a couple tips just a tip if you guys can't get that uh, rotor screw out sometimes if this is stuck on go ahead and take your hammer if you were going to be reusing this rotor you'd want to hit uh, the hammer between the uh, studs for the lug nuts but since I'm replacing it I'm just hitting around on the surface area There we go. And also, it's a good idea if you really wanted to get crazy, you go in here with a little metal grinder, grind all this rust away, put some anti seize on there before you put the new rotor on. There's new rotor. Get my little screws that we took out. The rotor screws. Some guys say not to reuse these, but I think it makes it easier. The job easier when the rotor is actually in place and secured. You can actually buy these little screws. Most auto parts stores, O'Reilly's would have them. AutoZone, Pet Boys, Napa. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh,